Hello and welcome to the video edition of College Techo. In this video, we will explain all about MSc in Psychology course. In this video, we will be covering all the details regarding the course admission process, fee structure, eligibility criteria, jobs and salary. Let's get started with the overview first. MSc Psychology course is the two-year postgraduate degree program divided into four equal semesters. Clinical psychology and the study of various treatment and procedure are covered in the MSc Psychology degree program. The major goal of this degree is to teach both normal and abnormal brain functioning as well as to use as an objective to treat people with emotional and mental difficulties. MSc Psychology syllabus covers are divided into four equal semester and one for two years. MSc Psychology syllabus allows students to develop psychological approach to assist patients in overcoming mental and behavioral obstacles. The goal of this syllabus is to provide advanced knowledge in a number of psychology areas and branches. As per admission criteria, after passing the MSc Psychology and Physics examination, students are given admission to top colleges, which is followed by a round of course and interview. DUET, GNU, AEI, PUSAT, OUSAT, WITSAT, BHU, PET, and other are some of the top entrance examinations. MSc Psychology course fee ranges between 3,000 to 2 lakh. Also, some reputed university provide grants in MSc psychology fees to reserve category students. Starting MSc Psychology salaries for graduates range in between 3 lakh to 20 lakh. Also, colleges, universities, development laboratories and other organizations employ graduates of this degree. Psychologists, educational psychologists, urban planning officers and more are job profiles available to the graduates. In addition to this, an MSc Psychology course with an MPhil or PhD is also an option. Candidates with an MSc in Psychology have a variety of work and higher education possibilities after their graduation. In addition to this, here we have the list of popular specialization courses. The first we have clinical psychology. Professionals use medical procedures to assess and treat patients. Then in cognitive psychology, it is another type of course in which a research of field that looks at human mind process from a scientific standpoint. Then in development psychology, it is the study of how people, groups, and society evolve intellectually, socially, emotionally over the course of their life. Then we have counseling psychology. It is one of the most prevalent psychology course for psychologists to focus on persons who have adjustment issues. Psychologists work as a counselor in a variety of settings, including human. Then we have educational psychology in the psychologist with school, colleges, universities, institutes, and academies develop a strategy to improve learning process. Then we have forensic psychology. In the psychologists use their expertise to deduce and analyze crime scenes as well as assess law enforcement and criminal investigation. Then we have social psychology. In this, the psychologists investigate how people influence one's behavior, beliefs, and feelings. The next we have is the eligibility criteria. Candidate interested in pursuing this degree must meet the below mentioned eligibility criteria in order to be considered for college admission. So first, a BA or BSc psychology degree from a recognized university with an aggregate of at least 50% marks is the eligibility criteria. Then, student with any degree such as Bachelor of Social Work, a Bachelor of Sociology, Bachelor of Science in Home Science, Bachelor of Arts in Philosophy, or Bachelor of Education with Psychology paper is also eligible. Then candidate must have a bachelor's degree and secured at least 50% in class 12th. And also by the time of admission, the applicant must be at least 21 years old. Moving on to the types of psychology courses. Psychology courses are very high in demand in India. Students can select from a variety of courses based on their individual interests and preferences. Full-time and distance learning alternatives are also available in this degree. Now let us quickly look at the admission process. An MSc Psychology entrance exam and a merit list is used to determine the admission process. By merit-based admission, universities create a merit list for their course based on students' graduation grades. The institution's MSc Psychology cutoff list or marks must be made by interested candidates to be considered for the admission process for admission through entrance exam. Colleges and universities like Delhi University or Jawaharlal University admit students based on their entrance examination performance. Also, there is a round of counseling and a personal interview after the admission process for the final selection. Adding on here is a list of some of the top MSc Psychology entrance examinations. The first we have is JNUEE, then BHU PET, then DUET, IPU set, OU set, and BITSAT. 
Now we will look at the list of some of the best MSc psychology colleges in India along with their average annual fee. So first we have Mount Carmel College, average annual fee is 75,000. Then we have Gen University Bangalore, average annual fee 105,000. Then we have Banaras Hindu University, average annual fee 6,700. Then we have Lems University Jaipur, average annual fee 12,000. Then we have Presidency College Chennai, average annual fee 9300. Then we have Christ University, average annual fee 94500. In addition, the MSc Psychology course fee varies depending on the college or institution. MSc Psychology fee usually ranges between 20,000 and 3 lakh annually. Now let us take a glance at the syllabus. Students will get practical and theoretical experience through this course curriculum which comprises both core and elective courses. In first year, there are two semesters and in the first semester, students will learn about cognitive psychology, statistics and behavioral sciences, research methods in psychology, neuropsychology, practical and seminar. Then in second semester, there is cognitive psychology part 2, experimental drug theory, psychometric theory, neuropsychology theory, practical and seminar. Then in third semester, they will be studying about psychology of social behavior theory, application of psychology, personality theory, system and skill and synopsis. In fourth semester, they will be studying about dynamics and interpersonal behavior theory, application of psychology part two, self and positive psychology, system and skill inventions and dissertation. Career options and job prospect after MSc psychology course. MSc psychology jobs can be found in range of medical settings and sectors. This course field in India offers a wide range of professional opportunities and is continually evolving. Graduates of this degree get skills and qualifications that will help them in their future career as psychologists. Work in range of organizations and industries is possible after completing this degree. For recent MSc psychology course graduates, the following job choices are available. They can work as psychologists, educational psychologists, social psychologists, urban planning officers, staff recruiters, human resource assistant. Adding on about the salary, an MSc psychology course graduate can earn a lot of money depending upon their experience, study subjects, specialization field and other factors. An MSc psychology course graduate can expect to earn salary between 5 lakh to 9 lakh on an average. Increased profits can be attributed to years of experience as well as the quality of one's work. In conclusion, it is critical to look into the available job options after completion of the degree. With this MSc Psychology degree in hand, you may rest assured that your hard work and analytical attitude will pay off in the form of fulfilling employment. So this was all about MSc Psychology course details, admission fees, eligibility criteria, syllabus, job salary and career aspects. In case you need any career related guidance, feel free to call at our student helpline number that is 1-800-572-9877 and talk to our experts. For more such informative videos, stay tuned to College Deco. If you like this video, do like, share, comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel.